Hello, this is the Slow Food Survivalist. In the following video, I will show you how to install detailed topographic maps covering about 1100 square kilometers, that is about 450 square miles, into Garmin eTrex 10 GPS navigator. According to Garmin, there are no commercially available maps for the entry level eTrex 10, and it should not be possible to install any maps to it. That is partially true. There really are no commercially available maps, but fortunately the internet is full of Garmin compatible free maps and it is ridiculously easy to install them into your Garmin device. And this is how it works. Once you have found an .img map file covering your desired area, download it into your computer. Then connect your Garmin with the computer At first, Garmin will save its trip logs. Then you will see a pop-up window asking what to do. At this point, click View Folders and Files. Apologies about the Finnish language on the screen. Please ignore it and just listen. In the next window, you will see the content of your Garmin device. Now open the Garmin folder and delete the gmap bmap file. If for some reason you want to save the original Garmin base map, copy it to someplace safe. Next, drag your .img map file into the Garmin folder. Copying the map file should take about two minutes. When the copying is done, rename your map file to gmap bmap. This way your Garmin is cheated to believe that your new map is actually Garmin's own base map. Then disconnect Garmin from the computer and you are ready to go. Now it is time to check what the map looks like. In this case I am about 175 kilometers or 110 miles away from my newly installed map area. Therefore I have to zoom out a little bit. And there that tiny bluish spot is my new map. Not too impressive at the first glance. But when I move the arrow to the map area and zoom in I begin to see something. As you can see, the area covered is about 24 by 48 kilometers, that is about 15 by 30 miles. The thick bluish lines are major highways, and the greenish areas are lakes and rivers. Still not very impressive at all. But when I continue zooming in, the map begins to reveal more and more details. For example, here the thick blue line is a single lane logging road and the dashed line is a narrow path leading to a public fireplace, which is also conveniently marked onto the map. To give you some idea about the scale of these maps, I took a picture from here, and as you can see, rather narrow walking trails are now clearly visible in my Garmin eTrex 10. So, as seen in this video, it is very easy to install extremely detailed maps with contour lines and everything into your eTrex 10. And if you cannot find these maps from your area, the internet is full of instructions how to make your own maps from scratch. And if you can settle with a little less detailed maps, openstreetmap.org pages are a good place to begin your search. It is a matter of luck how detailed maps you can find, but if you can find any maps at all, they are definitely better than the original Garmin worldwide base map. Hope you enjoyed the video and thank you for watching.